rains. Now, despite seeing the soggy conditions today, the drought monitor was also updated. It's updated every single Thursday and about 40 or 4.6% of our state, I should say, is under some form of droughts. But you'll notice abnormally dry conditions, about 36.5% has once again returned to parts of the Willamette Valley and the northwest corner of Oregon. So a flash drought. That's what we are currently experiencing where we went from no drought situation whatsoever to abnormally dry. So that is the sudden moisture evaporation all due to the warmer than average temperatures and those strong easterly winds that helped us to get back up to the warming trend. And now we got to prepare for a dry spring potential and a hot and dry summer, which of course brings up the topic of conversation. Could we potentially see an active wildfire season? Well, it's too hard to say right now, but at least over the past month or so, we have seen degrading conditions for the northwest corner of our state with brief improvements over the northeast corner of the state. So overall, we still would like to see the moisture return to our area, especially for places like Mount Hood, where the snow is actively falling right now. And the National Weather Service out of Portland issuing a winter weather advisory all above about 4,500 feet. That's where we could see about eight to 15 inches of snow above 5,000 feet.